Hello and welcome to my review on the brand new 2023 13-foot animated LED Jack Skellington from the Home Depot. He's available online for $399 and will be hitting stores the week of August 14th. We were made aware of his place in their 2023 Halloween lineup back in March of this year, but it was only last week when we truly got to lay our eyes on everything this prop entails. The 13-foot Jack Skellington animatronic is the largest movie realistic form of the Pumpkin King on the market. He has servo motors for an animated head, interchangeable facial expressions, a timer of six hours on and 18 hours off, mouth and head movement, posable arms, and sings three verses from a signature lament. He does not talk though, so the box is a little misleading in that regard. At the upper left corner, we get a depiction of Zero, and just below are portraits of Jack and Sally. There's standard shipping information on the back and side of the box, but on the opposite side is another label where the mayor can be seen this time next to a tombstone celebrating the 30th anniversary of the Nightmare Before Christmas. A condensed description of Jack can be found as well, and just underneath credits to Danny Elfman's Jack's Lament. The box barely fits on my desk and was a challenge to get up the stairs and into my room, so let's take it right back down again and open it up. Here is Jack's components spread out in chronological order, making our assembly process much quicker and efficient. Beginning with the base and shoes, you've got poles with some foam padding to ensure that it kind of fills out a little bit when he's fully assembled. I made the mistake of taking them off, mistaking them for shipping protection. Do not do what I did. They are part of it. You've got a piece to attach the legs as well as a waist ring, the main chest module, our metal tether to ensure he does not lean too far forward. Of course, his attire. Moving on to the arms, they're just right angle metal rods with some tubing around them. They cannot be adjusted at the elbow. Instead, they are movable at the shoulder part of the torso. Where that connects is where you can have them pretty much however you want. There is a lot of mobility when they're connected. Taking a look at Jack and his interchangeable eyes, none are installed at the moment, which looks very odd. I just wanted to show you how that looked. Moving down, he's got an amazing purple color for the mouth and tongue yellowing teeth and the signature stitches for the smile. This part is rubber or silicone. It's very mushy. I was surprised by that, but I, I shouldn't be. I just did not expect to have this rubber neck right underneath. It fits really well though and matches kind of the texture of this hard plastic. Moving on, you've got the metal rod, which connects to the top part of the torso, a wire, and then of course the bat bow tie, which looks great. You of course have your four fingered pair of hands, some stakes at the bottom, four metal rods which protrude out to provide extra stabilization at the base and then lastly our power adapter so with everything spread out let's go ahead and build the 13 foot tall jack skellington animatronic from home depot
do, I am the best, for my talents are renowned far and wide. When it comes to surprises in the moonlit night, I excel without ever even trying. With the slightest little effort of my ghost-like charms, I have seen grown men give out a shriek. With the wave of my hand in a well-placed bow, I have swept the very bravest off their feet. And I, Jack, the pumpkin king, have grown so tired of the same old thing. and I'll scare you right out of your pants. To a guy in Kentucky, I'm Mr. Unlucky, and I'm known throughout England and France. And since I am dead, I can take off my head to recite Shakespearean quotations. No animal nor man can scream like I can with the fury of my recitations. Decided to transport him to the grass for a less distracting background with the trees, though he needs no assistance in standing out. At 13 feet tall, he's the perfect addition to Home Depot's gigantic Halloween prop series and is any Nightmare Before Christmas fan's dream. On the topic of size, you'll find he just dwarfs his other animatronic form. The six foot version looks like an offspring when put side by side. And if you own both, you might want to start figuring out how you can display them together. The six foot version might need to be sidelined or you can always play with scale. We've already established Jack's arms can be positioned how you please. However, I did not mention there's an option for his palms facing in or out. SVI, also known as Seasonal Visions or the manufacturer of this prop, was smart to include another hole at the end of the arms to allow for this. More specifically, you get roughly 135 degrees to play with in several notch settings so that if you happen to encounter someone else's Jack Skellington, is a very low chance that you will share the same position. It can be unique. Right above Jack's left foot is the control box. Four settings to choose from as we lift his pant leg, lights only, timer, sensor, and off. The timer is a bit disappointing as there's no animation or sound with the timer. Those are exclusive to the sensor and try me settings. You've got the Nightmare Before Christmas logo on your control box, the volume knob, and this is located towards the bottom as opposed to the midsection, which is common for the SVI large props. With this one, much like the Phantom, you've got it down here. All around, he is pretty extraordinary, but I do wish there was some more animation. Any extra movement would have gone a long way, whether it's servo in the eyes instead, crinkling fingers or a twisting waist, I personally would have forked out another 100 or 200 more to bring the Pumpkin King to life even more so than SVI already has. A few last minute points I'd like to go over. Building time for two people is anywhere from 45 minutes to an hour. All depends on the competency of who you've chosen to help you. In my case, it was a little questionable at times. Additionally, at $399, I do believe this is a fair price point. Materials are strong. Just be smart about securing and not having jack up in strong winds. You'll then have a broken Pumpkin King. Lastly, I want to thank you all so much for watching my review on Home Depot's 2023 Star Prop. This actually makes you feel like you're in the presence of Jack Skellington and a resident of Halloween Town. This honors the Nightmare Before Christmas more than anything else. I couldn't have selected a better option for the 30th anniversary. Thanks again for watching. I'll see you later. Peace out. Bye. What I do, I am the best, for my talents are renowned far and wide. When it comes to surprises in the moonlit night, I excel without ever even trying. With the slightest little effort of my ghost-like charms, I have seen grown men give out a shriek. With the wave of my hand in a well-placed bow, I have swept the very bravest off their feet. And I, Jack, the pumpkin king, have grown so tired of the same old thing. Oh, somewhere deep inside of these bones,